Ginger. That's a stub. Yeah. Well, it's going to hopefully she has come loose. Everything was, and when she snapped, that snapped. You hear it snap. Now I'm going to get another uh, bolt. Just put the alternator on. And then we're just going to put the serpentine belts on and uh, hook it up to the uh, carburetor. Not carburetor, but alternator should be good to go. Dutch. This is Dutch, everybody. Me. Yeah. There's Ginger. Ginger. <laughs> hey, Ginger. Hello. Hey there, Ginger. Hey, Dutch. <laughs> well, you want to come say hello, eh? Hey, Ginger. I'm going to give you some love, too. Hey. A little flies on you, eh? Got some water? I don't got very much. I'm gonna have to give you some water, yeah? See what I can do for you. Be right back. I just fed these guys some water. They're all good to go and they're all happy. Hey. Hey. Here's Ginger. And there's Dutch. You guys are all happy? They're eating the grass. They're all happy. Here you go. Enjoy. I checked in there. I checked here. I sort of checked in here. I have to empty all that fucking shit out of there. That's that bolt will hold for now, hopefully. Temporarily. No, it's just to the expire, right? I gotta put the charger on it, too. Yeah. Going to my hands. I'm gonna get a wrench or ratchet on this. Excuse me, please. Let me go get a ratchet. Yeah. It's got to 15. Just give that a snug. I don't want to fucking ruin that. So I need another 15, right? Yeah, 
Oh, here comes Stacy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's the update on the uh, 94 uh, GMC Sierra SLS 6.5 turbo diesel. So here's an update. 1500. So here's the update. Alternator is in. Battery is in. But it will not start. The reason for not starting is because there is a computer sensor thinamajiggy that is not functioning and needs to be replaced. Which is causing it not to turn over. Plus the battery shot. Needs a new battery too. So that's basically what's going on with it. It won't turn over because of the computer system. Uh, it's shot and needs to be replaced plus the battery. And we, as you can as already seen, we replaced the alternator on it. Well, we put the original alternator back in it. So... But I will update you guys on the can talk. But I will update you guys on whenever it does run and we get it going and stuff like that. I will update you guys. But it probably won't be free for a very long time. But uh if I uh get a chance to do any more content on it, I will uh eventually show you guys and we'll leave it at that for now. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, I, like I said, I will update you guys on whenever it does uh, run, and stuff like that, and we'll go from there. So uh, hope you guys enjoy. Please leave a comment, like, make sure to subscribe, turn on notification bell so you know each and every time I do post a video or go live. And I think we'll leave it at that for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll talk to y'all later. Just pull on them. You have to pull it forward like that. Pull oh, forward? You don't yank on that. You break that one of these. And this oh, pull okay. is impossible to take out. So you pull it in and you put it up. You don't pull down on them. You pull gently. You feel how gentle this stuff is? Very light duty. Very light. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't want grease in my steering wheel. Your gloves aren't dirty, but... So that's how it is, okay? okay. In, up, and down. All right. So count the clicks. You can't... I don't know if the engagement's working. Okay, go ahead. One, two, that's it. Perfect. Okay, so when it starts to move, then you're going to steer. You never steer a wheel standing still. Because there are no hydraulics helping you here, right? So yeah. once it starts to roll, you can gently try. Just get that gentle arc to go over there. Okay. Right. Only the power in here. Just it okay. What's going on you guys? I'm just doing a bit of a clip here. Oh, we need a little sloshing chain.